Hi, this is Gary with MacMost Now. In today's episode, let me show you how to capture the screen of your iPad on your Mac without any special cables or hardware. So back in episode 546, I showed you how to use Apple's HDMI adapter, bring it through a cable into an HDMI capture card and capture the screen of your iPad or your iPhone on your Mac. Well, now there's an easier technique thanks to the ability for an iPad and the new iPhone to share using AirPlay and an app that you have to get for your Mac. So the app you need on your Mac is called AirServer and you get it at airserverapp.com. Uh, it's not free. It costs uh, and you can get it for $15 for your Mac. But it's a lot cheaper than even the cables you need to do it with the hardware method. And when I run Air Server, I get it up here as an icon on my menu bar and I can change things, uh, go to preferences and such, or set it to launch on startup. But to initiate it, I go back to my iPad here and I use AirPlay by going to the bottom menu bar here. I'll show you in a second. Uh, and I can select, in addition to seeing my Apple TV here uh, as an AirPlay device, I can select my Mac. And then you can see it appear here on my Mac appears in a window. You can see what I just did. This was my this is my iPad screen on my Mac. And I had selected at the bottom bar here on the controls AirPlay. And then I had selected my Mac here as the AirPlay device and had mirroring turned on. So now on my iPad here you can see everything that I do. Um, and the Air Server window here appears as a regular window. I can resize it. Uh, as I want, I can bring up some post processing controls uh, like this, like sharpen and uh, brightness controls, move that around. So, for instance, I can adjust the brightness there. Um, and then I can uh, also go full screen like that. And as you can see, of course, um, I can easily use this as a way to uh, record the screen here because all I need to do on top of this is use screen recording software like I am for making this video and record my Mac's screen and I get everything that's being shown on my iPad. So this could be very useful if you're uh, showing something on your Mac, say you're presenting and you want to show something on your iPad, you don't have to switch, you could just use this app. If you want to record something, like say if you're an app developer uh, or a tutorial maker and you want to record things going on on your iPad, you can use this. Then any screen recording software will capture uh, what's going on on your screen then and you can create a recording of what's going on on your iPad with no additional cables, just this piece of software. And of course you need an iPad. Uh, the iPad 2 or the new iPad or you could do this using the iPhone 4S all which have the capability to do AirPlay streaming to video. If you can do it to an Apple TV then you can do it to Air Server and uh, use Air Server to see and record your iPad screen. So I hope you found this useful. Till next time this is Gary with MacMost Now. Want more video tutorials? Just go to MacMost.com, click on the videos link at the top of the page and then you can view all of the hundreds of MacMost videos by category.